my name is Ronnie. Welcome back to my channel. So this video, I'm going to review all of Cher's perfumes. As some of you know, let me fix this a little. Okay, th th there. Stay. Okay. <laughs> I have a new ring light, so this um, phone holder kind of gives me a little anxiety because it doesn't have like the um, cushions, but it has like those um, grip holders. So anyway, I actually like this light way better. I'm actually gonna, I'm gonna use this as my makeup light. Huh. Anyway, so I'm reviewing all of Cher's perfumes. So some of you may know this, and I'm gonna want to mention this in one of my. I'm gonna do like a fun facts about me video in the future, as long as like how I got into dancing and how I got into accounting, like from stripper to accountant type story. But some of you know or may not know, my dancer name was Sherilyn. My full-on model name was Sherilyn Corleone. It's a whole story, but. <laughs> want to do the share effect but Sherilyn is Cher's real name so I've kind of always idolized her because she's like Armenian I'm part Armenian I'm Armenian Jewish Mexican so let's get into it and she is queen and she is a rich man so let's get into it so I have like these little notebook papers of to like spray them on and oh, what is up with this baby hair today? Anyway, mm. Mm. anyway, so I have these little notebook papers to spray them on and I bought these at Walmart and they were like less than $10 and um, they're on, like, they were like 20 bucks, and then they were like half off at Walmart, and then I, um, anyway, then I, um, let's see, what was I say? Oh, yeah. Then I found it on Amazon for like less than 10 bucks, so I think this line is going to be around for a while. This is from her Decade line. It's not from her. Like, she has an actual perfume out, which I wore for my wedding, then I gifted it to my mom. But this is actually from the Decade line, so let's get started. We will start with the 60s, of course. She looking cute. I know I should have figured out how to get rid of the tags, but whatever. Huh? Bougie on a budget. So... I love the design of this. It's really cute. Very 60s. So, let's smell it. Smell it on the paper. Okay, you know what this reminds me of? It smells like rich old white lady. Like that, like it smells like that lady that you want to be, you know? Like, I'm not hating it. It's just, I wouldn't really, I might wear it at night, but not really like a everyday type thing. Next one is the 70s. I love it. So cute and pink. The little glitters and the little pink. Mm. So I'm not really, I'm drinking champagne, but like I'm using it to, oh, didn't mean to flip anyone off, <laughs> but to um cleanse the nose palette, I guess, or whatever that is. 
clear my senses. So let's the 70s. So I kind of used this one already, so I already know what this one smells like. This is like my nice daytime perfume. Mm. It smells so clean and, you know, it's so weird. I wear this one all the time and like, it just triggered me now. What it smells like, why I love it so much, is it smells like Love's Baby Soft. Who remembers Love's Baby Soft? Like, that's like every freaking bitch's first perfume. So, like, it's very nostalgic. Like, I love it. This is the 80s one. I'm not hating the, the design of it. It's cute. It's so weird that some of these came with lids and some of them didn't. I'm not hating. I always throw away the lid too for some reason. love it love this one it's like kind of fruity I can't really describe it. it's like flowery and fruity at the same time so here's the last one it is the 90s which the year I was born I'm a 90s baby mm -mm 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 -mm. drink to that so you know what the design reminds me of so much is who remembers Tommy girl like I think I wore Tommy girl in junior high like that's what this is reminds me of Tommy girl like Tommy Hilfiger like it's definitely giving me that era Bitch, open. This is very like vanilla and jasmine. Like, I like it. So, in all, I am going to do probably this one first, the 82nd, the 70s first, I mean, whoa, 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 wait, 90s first, 82nd, 70s third, and my least was rich old white lady. But I'm not hating on any of them, just three out of four of them are good daytime perfumes. And even if you're not a Cher fan, I would definitely recommend getting these. Mm. Wait a minute. Totally random. I think the reason why I don't like the 60s one is it smells like my mother. Like what she uses. So, that's probably it. I think I might just gift that one to my mom, but thank you for watching this video. I know it was really short, but I'm being in, like I said, being an accountant, it's like crazy job. So on my days off, I'm going to be booking and filming so many videos that they might be out of order, but 
just go with it. <laughs> anyway, please follow me on Instagram at Reina Ronnie. And please like, subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.